Thank you for tuning in. The following footage was shot in 2018. This was the last time the All Blacks faced the Springboks in South Africa. This was a weekend where a friend and I, we traveled up to uh, Johannesburg from Cape Town where we just witnessed the mighty All Blacks take on the Springboks. So guys, enjoy this vlog. Thank you. Okay, so we finally arrived in, uh, in global country. This is global country, this guys. I'm a big Western province man. <laughs> 100 bucks for parking. We don't know the area. We don't know where the, the free parking is here. So we end up paying 100 bucks for parking. This is definitely not Newlands. <laughs> <laughs> There's a downgrade from Newlands. <laughs> I think we are. Downgrade. I think we in Cape Town are very privileged uh, to, have, to have such a beautiful, a beautiful city. Um, but yes. We came here for the rugby. Okay, so this is us. This is us. Um, yeah, at, at Loftus. Loftus, we have the same thing. Can you believe it? Yeah. Loftus, Yeah, yeah, but. From Cape Mao, this is a little Alright, so this you're seeing here is the beer garden. This is the sports field adjacent to the stadium itself. And here we have the, I think this was the spring box arriving to the stadium. I had, oh, I think I messed up the footage here actually. <laughs> Due to the excitement, I, I took mostly footage from the guys' feet and the legs area. I didn't get in the, the heads and the faces. But this was the actual Springbok team arriving to the stadium. It was nice seeing the guys in flesh and blood. And I think the first guy climbing out of the bus was Faf the Clerk. So yeah, as you can hear, he got excited. Yeah, this Lano Mapu. Tim Willems are right there. And arriving here is the All Blacks. They arrived here. Yeah, very bad footage, but okay, that was the best I could do that time. Picture of my friend and I. And yeah, just living in the, the moment at Loftus. This is my first time at Loftus. And I really enjoyed my time at Loftus. Pyrotechnics. Beautiful. Always, I think for speedball games they always have these pyrotechnics, the ambience and for action and for this for the for the whole ambience at the stadium. Yeah, look at that. Look at that crowd people. Look at that. Loftus Versveld, Victoria. Very nice. Okay, I think yeah the song being sung here is World in Union. When I listen to the song, it takes me back to the 1995 Rocky World Cup. I always get that chills and goosebumps. Just listen to the song. Okay, and this is always a special moment where we are about to sing the national anthem in Kosi Sikalele and the best part is of record spot of the anthem at SA Stadium, the record spot, the stem, the I don't know why, but okay, it is what it is. <laughs> Enjoy this guys.
Alright, so the box were on attack here and Colby he almost scored the winning try. And I think this was in the last couple of minutes of the game where Colby almost scored the winning try. But the box lost the game. It was a very exciting game, good game. It's just a pity the box lost. And here's my face, the disappointment of the loss. Okay, this was very disappointing. But um, what an experience of being here at uh, Loftus to, 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 to witness a very close game between the Springboks and New Zealand. In this club, uh, apologies for my broken English, um, but I just, in this club I just share the warmness I felt from the people at Loftus. Yeah, so it was um, back, uh, above my expectation. As in Cape Town, we have a stereotypical view of the north, um, yes, but the uh, actually nice, it was my time. So yeah, nice apologies for the broken game English. Game Thank you. <laughs> we were so close of, um, in winning the game. Uh, with the Oblast came back in the last couple of months to, to win the game. But what I can say about uh, my experience at Lofte is that the, the people we sat uh, next to were very friendly. I think um, they, were, they were more friendlier than the Cape Townians, actually. Do you agree, as one? Yes. Because I had this lady, the, the, this lady next to me. Um, out of the blue, she, she gave me a, a, a hand. And she introduced herself to me, and uh, I introduced myself to her. She introduced me to her husband, to her kids, out of the blue. And um, I found that to be very, to be very interesting, to be very nice and welcoming. I then asked the lady uh, from where, from from where she. She told me they stay in Pretoria, very close to the stadium. My son goes to Af Af African so work school, which are uh, next to the stadium. And I then told her that I'm from, we come from Cape Town and she was very happy and said we're welcome, well, welcome to Loftus and I hope you enjoy your, your visit here. So uh, I found that to be very interesting and very, uh, very warming. Yeah, we didn't expect that um, from uh, Loftus. <laughs> Being in a blue ball country where the Afrikaans blood is running thick. But uh, yeah. It was really nice and very uh, surprising. So yes, we're going home now, go to our hotel. And uh, as you can see guys, there's a road. You can see the roads over here. Six lanes. We have like five lanes going down and five or five lanes going up. No wonder they paying so much toll uh, for uh, tolls. Because the road system here in, in Gauteng is amazing. Yeah, it, it is like... Uh, it's like surprise this song for the free road system in Gauteng. But yeah, thank you guys, thank you for listening, thank you for watching. Good night. Bye bye!